What are wives coming to? We refer, of course, to the wives of BAOR men in Germany who will make their homes there. These are blocks of communal flats, such as may be seen in Hamburg, Hanover and Brunswick. The army usually takes over a complete section of a town, turns out the inhabitants into alternative accommodation elsewhere and moves in. The requisitioned flats and houses are comfortably furnished and well heated. Our cameraman went round this district and also filmed the army type high street where modest little shops have been built for the soldiers' families. Quite a lot of shopping is done in naffy canteens. Feeding out in Brunswick at a club which provides recreational, social and helpful amenities. Writing and reading rooms as well as the most of the comforts of a small hotel in the one-time Hotel Lorenz where Hitler used to stay. In Hanover, there's an army warehouse stocked with furniture, cutlery and so on, from which are drawn most of the requirements to set up home. The kitchen utensils are not easy to come by. We made a more personal visit to the home of Sergeant Major Putland, Royal Artillery. He was moving in at the time. His furniture is all German-made. This is his first home since he was married nine years ago. Apart from being an expert with a gun, Putland knows his way about in the kitchen. And now over to Luton, Bedfordshire, to meet his wife with the question, whereabouts in Germany are you going? Well, George says it's Bad Oenheisen. I don't mind where it is as long as we're together. This sequence shows how an officer of the requisition quartering team sets about his work. This flat is in Hamburg and is to be taken over for a British wife. Other quarters are found for the present tenants. The officer points out the sitting room furniture that will be required and what she can keep for her own use. In Hanover, over 200 flats are still needed. These pictures may give you some idea of the conditions the wives of the BAOR men will meet with when they set up house in Germany. <laughs> 